Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We're back on Fallout 4, and I've been waiting to do this video. I knew about it a long time ago. I could have done it, um, I don't know, like, five, four or five days ago. I knew this was here, but this is going to be, uh, how to get the X0, how to get a full set of X01. Uh, this is going to be a little bit longer of a video because I'm going to get it, and then I'm going to upgrade it, I believe, to Mark 4. Uh, and so this will be a little bit longer of a video. I'm also going to show you everything in here at 35 Court. Upstairs, there is not much. Um, actually, there is nothing upstairs. Um, down here, there's some different bodies that you can loot. Um, I'm going to go ahead and loot them in this video. So this is going to be a little bit longer of the video. Like I said, um, there's going to be a little. There's going to be a little bit more of um, a little bit of gameplay, I guess, in this video. Uh, opposed to the other guides where there literally is no gameplay. It's just me doing whatever uh, And just showing you guys there'll be a little bit of gameplay in here I'm, I'm out of room because I bought a stupid minigun and I forgot to take it back to my house and store it in my safe So I have a bunch of crap on me that I have like 44 pounds between me and Dance that I can't even use I went to dance because I was getting sick of Kate um, she's kind of annoying, and she's super negative, and it's super hard to get her, um, like, it's super hard to get her to like you, and for some reason that gun, my 50 cal is doing no damage. This gun, it just reams, the spray and pray just reams, but my 50 cal for some reason was just doing no damage. Okay, uh, in here is, uh, a safe and a terminal, I'm gonna go ahead and lockpick first. Okay, bobby pin was at the end of its use. Okay, I think it's down. Yeah. Okay, but what I was saying is, oh, yes, yes, 2, 2mm ammo. All right. I guess I'll take the lighter. Why not? Okay, and then I'll do the terminal for the experience. Um, but like I was saying, she's kind of hard to get her... Um, what what is it like her i don't even know what it's called in this game her relationship up with you i guess or how much she likes you i don't really know what to call it um but like that type of it's hard to get it up with her because she doesn't like it when you're nice she doesn't like it when you help people she doesn't like and i'm like uh it's like i don't want to be a dick and like, I kind of like, not really role play, but I kind of like have a thing that I roll with through the whole game. And, um, okay, I don't need any of that stuff turned off. Um, like, there's a certain, like, way I'll just play the same way through the whole entire game. And I don't really want to mess around with having to do different stuff. Because I want to get the perks uh, for the different follow. So I'm on to dance now. Um, I only have pipers currently, but, like, I could get... I think Garvey, I think Preston's is pretty easy. Nick Valentine's is probably pretty easy. I think with Nick Valentine, you just have to be a good person. Um, I thought there was going to be kind of, you could use Jet, um, because it does make Kate like you, but it's not enough, and after a certain point, you have to use, like, four for, her to, for it to say Kate like that. Uh, so it just wasn't worth it. I'll probably go back to her in the future uh, and try to... Um, get her maxed out i guess it's like it's kind of like the karma scale i guess i don't really know what to call it. i don't know exactly what they called it um but max i need to i want to max it out with every character so i can get the perks um and for the amount of time i have played on this game i really am not <laughs> that far some of the time it is deceiving because i think i left my xbox on for like 12 hours or something while i was at class and then i came home and didn't get on the xbox forever so um there is like kind of a skewed time i have like almost two days played i think and i'm only level 30 i hate this when the elevator doesn't open okay that's the wrong way go this way why does what the heck was that okay anyway there is a novice door here i'm gonna go ahead and pick uh, okay, okay, uh, is it right on, is it right straight on, no, it's a little bit to the left, a little bit more, there we go, go um, 
but I'm like level 30 and I have all this time played and I'm like I need to actually progress the story so that's kind of what I'm working on right now is progressing the story so it looks like the only thing in here really is the safe uh, so let's go ahead and open that up did not mean to take that clipboard okay so I think nope it's down it's gonna be all the way down okay a little bit up mm, I think it's a little bit no not that far I'll blow it up it's kind of hard with the controller, with the little, with the joystick to that, to get it exactly where you want it. Like I know where it is here, but it's really hard to position it. A little bit farther. No, see, I went too far. Then I think, I, yeah, I went too far up there. Oh my gosh. I hate, I hate these lock picks that are like this. It pisses me off. It really does. Cause you gotta be so finicky with it. Sometimes when you break it, there we go. Sometimes when you break a bobby pin, it like it's it's like the game almost gets confused because sometimes it just automatically takes it if you get it anywhere near it after you miss it once. Okay, so when you come up here, you want to just run over and these things will light up and the sirens will go off. I always go for this kill first, um, or not all the time, but I would go for that kill first. And you can only do this one, so. I would do that, and then you can kill the sentry, and what you can do um, is just retreat down here, because he can't fit, the sentry, the sentry bot can't fit, okay, that was really close to me dying, Let's jab two stem packs in my leg, I kind of like how the stem pack thing is, where you jab it into your leg, it reminds me of Bloodborne, when that, because that's how you heal. And so, let's go ahead and you want to hit both buttons on both sides. That'll open this up. And there it is, X01 helmet, X01 torso, X01 left leg, left arm, right arm, right leg. It is a full set. Um, I believe if you come later in the game, um, I believe the X01 armor becomes available at level 28. But the higher marks that you can get from here become available later in the game. Um, but I felt like getting it now because I'm going to progress the story, so I kind of want to, I want to hop back into power armor. Uh, but let's go ahead and head back to, um, for some reason, it took me forever to find this stupid building again, the Custom House Tower, because it disappeared off my map for whatever reason, and I couldn't get it, I couldn't find the building. I ran around for like 25 minutes looking for it. Okay, back to Sanctuary. For some reason, people, my happiness in, th in Sanctuary is the most fluctuating BS ever because it goes like it, it got up to like 87 now it's back down to 60 something i don't really get why people aren't happy probably because i had I, I used a bunch of our resources in, the, in a whole house on power armor that that's now it's just a cluttered mess i need to see once again this is another one of those points where i'm doing something stupid um because I got lazy with the, I got lazy with my power armor display. I just have some random power armors just sitting here. Like, look at this. I just got, I just have random power armors sitting. Okay, so let me hop out of the X01 here. I need to move one of these power armors. Um, let's move this one. I need to get. See, I need helmets. I wish I. I feel like it's kind of cheating buying helmets. I kind of want to find it. Kind of want to find helmets. Okay, X01, let's just get it into the bay, um, it'll position it. Okay, you really do look like a friggin' bug in this armor, but it is the best armor, and it does look decently cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and craft. Okay, so Mark 1, I oh, I can get it up to Mark 5. I would need armor rank 4. Can I get armor rank? Well, this is the question. Can I get armor rank 4? I need... I have two level ups. Where is arm? I... Oh, no, you gotta be level 39. Okay, so I can get it up to mark 4. So I can get it close. I save my level up points for when I need them. Like, throughout playing. So let's go ahead and upgrade it to... Or mark 5, sorry. We can upgrade it to mark 5. I need to wait to get to mark six. So go ahead and get that. And then I don't know what paint I want on this thing. Could put the EMP 
shielding. That's kind of lame. That's not like a color. I don't know. I'm not going to mess with that right now. So mod. Removes radiation from consumed food and water. Ooh, that's pretty good. Rat scrubber. That's me. See, I want to really... That's why I'm kind of in this video just kind of going in depth with this armor because I'm going to be using it. So might as well go through it. Increases intelligence. Uh, slightly slight aiming marks enemies with a compass pip. I don't need that. Um, visor highlights living targets. That is sweet. That is awesome. What do I? Oh, I lack science. Dude, that's sick. I want that. I want this. I want the... T okay, I need science up. I need science up. See, this is kind of... This is like my normal videos that I do. Non... Like, really informal video... Or... Not informal. Uh, yeah. Yeah, informal. Non... For I think it's informal. See? See, this is, this is how it goes. Okay, so science rank 3. I can get it. Sweet. Sweet. But this is how my videos very unprofessional i guess is how i put it there we go pretty unprofessional but okay so what else was locked uh, okay yep i want this targeting hud because that just sounds awesome and i kind of the red tactical i think is the cool way to go um but i kind of want the blue i don't really know what the vault boy is supposed to be and yeah, I'm going to go with the blue. It's not as cool as the other one, but... I don't really know what paint I want. Reduces damage from explosions. Prism shielding. Speed and sunlight. sunlight really. Um, titanium plating. That just increases the health. Military. Increases strength. Agility. Okay, I'm not going to mess with that just yet. Uh, I need blacksmith for this. Unarmed attacks. Unarmed. Reduces action point cost for power attacks. Okay, I really don't need that. So let's upgrade this to Mark V. I really don't need that stuff for the arms. Right arm. Upgrade that to Mark V. Okay, let's see what the mods are for the legs. Oops, miscellaneous, calibrated shocks, okay, carry weight, that's in the lead right now, is the carry weight. Uh, action point, okay, that's actually probably in the lead, the sprinting. No, I don't want that. Increases action point refresh speed while moving. Um, okay, this is actually a hard one, do I want optimized servos? Reduces action point for cost for sprinting or carry weight. It's kind of a difficult one. I guess I could have one leg. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to have one leg be optimized servos. And I'll have one leg be... What the heck is low? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah, the right leg is the one I didn't do. I don't know why I was reading it wrong in my head. Increases carry, right? Wait, wait, wait. which one did I do? Optimize, so that is... Yeah, okay, so I need the calibrated shocks on this one. Okay, and then the torso. Mark 5. Seems kind of like a waste, because I'm going to have to waste a bunch of stuff to get Mark 6 here soon. Okay, core science rank 4 is what I need for a bunch of stuff. Okay, Tesla Coil is winning right now. The jetpack is awesome. Um, that's pretty cool, but I don't really need it. I pay really good attention to my health, usually. Um, blood cleanser. I don't really use drugs that much, so I don't really need that. I think right now it's probably Core Assembly or Tesla Coils. I'm guessing I'm going to go with Tesla because that's just cool. Um, yeah, I think we're going... It's so hard. It's a hard decision. 
I'm gonna go with the Tesla. It's just more fun. Okay, now, what paint do I want? Now I gotta decide on paint. I kind of want to go with the stupid hot rod flames, but they're just so generic. I don't know. You know what I find? It's hard to see what it looks like. Like, because it's highlighted, it's really hard to tell what it looks like. So you have to, like, kind of paint it and then figure out if you like the paint. Titanium. I might just go titanium plating. I kind of want to go with the hot... We're going hot rod flames because it's free, so I can see what it looks like. I think that's a good idea. We'll go Hot Rod Flames because it's free, and if I like it, I can just stick with the Hot Rod Flames. Okay. Hot Rod Flames. Just Hot Rod Flames and more Hot Rod Flames. Okay, no material. There we go. Coiled Flame. Okay, everything is Hot Rod. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. Might roll hot rod flames for right now. Yeah, hop into this thing. We gotta I gotta check this out. I've got to check this out. You literally look like a friggin' bug in this thing. Look at you, you look like a beetle. You literally look like a beetle in a suit of You look like a metal beetle on two legs in this thing. Dude, that is so okay, so it turns things loop. Really? Really? You're gonna... These things... These dudes... Actually gonna come... I can't even tell... Really? They're rad roaches? They're not even like... We have a rad roach infestation and everybody has just gone crazy. Look at this. Look at this. And I need to give people guns because these people are out here meleeing with the dog. There's literally like two... But this is sweet that it turns people red. Things that are living. This. All right. So I'm liking my custom power armor. Um, the hot rod flames. I don't know. I thought the headlamp was supposed to. I thought the design of the headlamp on the X01. Maybe it's only the Mark VI. Not. Man, people just hopped in power armor. Hey, Kate. You just gonna you just gonna go and jack my power armor? Like, what the? Get out of my power armor. I'm gonna have to, like, secure my power armor place so people don't... Or I need to just put a bunch of crappy power armor in the front so they steal that. But I don't know why... How do you get them out of the power armor? This is, like, this is like a whole new aspect to this video is the fact that Kate is stealing one of my power armors that I had on display. Do I get her out of my power armor? That's Paladin Dance. Where did Kate go? Kate, get out of my power armor. No, I'm not ready to head back out. I want you out of my power armor. Alright, whatever. 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 Alrighty, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was something a little bit different. Something a little bit longer. Um, something a little bit less uh, formal, I guess, is what I'm going to label it. A little less formal. Kind of my traditional videos where I just kind of... I kind of show something, but I kind of BS around during the video. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed, and um, if someone knows how to get her out of my power armor, uh, let me know, and that would be really nice so that I can put it back where it belongs, because actually she could have stolen like half of these power armors out of here and I wouldn't have cared, but that one's like the only T45 full set power armor that I have, so I'm like... Can we not steal the one power armor I don't have any other of? It's the same as if she took, like, the piezonucleic power armor that's right here. Um, but that's going to do it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys in the next one, which will probably be a little bit more formal and professional than this one was. But I'll catch you guys then. Peace out.